Hey everybody, welcome back. Today is Saturday, April 25th, and I am coming to you with a long, long, long wait for this unboxing. Between the holiday, fires, and coronavirus, this, this baby has had a journey. I have been so excited for this. I have been watching my tracking. Oh, I am so happy that it is finally here. And, you know, for the most part, it looks like it survived its journey. The box is in pretty good shape considering what it's had to go through. Now, this here is a custom diamond painting. There is another one out there that is almost identical to it. This happens to be a square. Pardon the nails. This uh, stay at home <laughs> has not been under the stay at home orders have not been good on my nails. But anyway, that was a squirrely moment. There's like I said, there's another painting out there that looks almost identical, other than one is round and one is square. One is right here in Las Vegas, Nevada. And the other one is in North Dakota. This is going to be a collab that myself and Ash Inc. 93 are going to be doing together. Um, I reached out to Rachel in, from Treasure Studio Arts. It's Treasure Studios Art, excuse me. Um, in December and asked her if she could me do a custom it was gonna be a surprise or like more like a, like a mystery custom to me um, and then she let me know which I knew um, at the time but that she did not that she could do a custom and it could be a surprise the thing is is it wouldn't necessarily be a surprise to me and I'm sorry for the noise Ugh. The computer's going to be updating and Facebook notifications and all that. So please um, bear with me on that. But um, she said she could do it, but it wouldn't end up being a mystery then because it does have the image on thumbnail on the canvas. Um, so she said the only way she could do that, she could do it up, but, you know, she said I'd have to have, like, somebody, you know, cover it for me. I was like, no, I mean... I, the only thing that I wanted it to be a surprise to me was, is I did not want to know, I didn't want to know what she did until I got it. So I have no idea. I had no idea what this looked like. So absolutely. She said she would you know, work on it. She just needed to get through her holiday orders and that was fine. There was no big rush for it. And when she got to it, she got to it. So then the fires in Australia happened. We just get... You know, she just gets her production moving from that when we had the outbreak from the virus. So it's taken some time. She has been so wonderful throughout this whole process and keeping me updated and keeping in, t in contact with me and apologizing so much. And Rachel, there was never a need to apologize. This was nothing that you had any control over, as well as you were doing me a favor. So I could not ask for, you know, anything more than what you've done. I mean, you have been exceptional and I appreciate that so, so much. So me and Amber from Ash Inc. 93 have been We've been watching the tracking and it has sat for, I, I told, I messaged Rachel yesterday and jokingly said that I think that, um, my diamond painting had gotten hijacked <laughs> because it sat 
for like two weeks in just between two different locations. It just sat. And it was like updating every so many hours, but it was updating that it was still at that location. And so that went on with one location and went on for like five, about five days, I think. And then it went to another location and it sat for another five days. So yes, I've been, <laughs> I have been long awaiting this and I am so happy that it is here. Me and Amber mes messaged and video chatted before I started recording this. Um, we were just beside herself with excitement. So we decided we're going to go ahead and get our videos recorded. And I've made you wait long enough and I know I've waited long enough. So let's get into this. It is a heavy box. I'm sorry, the, the view is not going to be good. Um, because I've got to get a different setup. So... I'm going to do the best that I can. I will have pictures of the canvas in full, you know, the full canvas I will take and put on my Instagram and on my Facebook. Oh my goodness sakes. This is, this has got some weight to it. I mean, this has definitely, definitely got some weight to it. And the long awaited little pink satchel. Oh my gosh. I have been so excited. Oh my goodness sakes. So, for those of you who have never seen a Treasure Studios art toolkit, comes in this absolutely adorable pink little satchel that I will keep forever. It also comes with two big plates of wax. They're connected. A little pink squishy, a single placer, and I think this is a six or seven placer. I'm not sure because I don't use those very often. I can't control the putting it down. It always gets crooked. So it also comes with, all right, so this must be a nine placer. So it must be a nine placer, a six placer, and a three placer. It also comes with these adorable pink tweezers. They are the, round, the blunt ends, so they're not sharp and pointy, which I love this because I have this, the <clears throat> I have those sharp ones. Let me see if I can find a pair here. Handy and probably not. Let me see. I know I've got to have a pair of tweezers up here somewhere. Yes. So the difference, I apologize for that. The difference between TSA's tweezers and other company, this happens to be Diamond Art Club, but sorry about that, is, well, not only are TSA's pink, but they're also the blunt end. These are probably able to be used, since I haven't used these yet, they'll probably be able to use these for both round and square. But these ones are the pointy tweezers. These are from Diamond Art Club. These are sharp, and they're also black. So that's the difference. But I have been so excited about receiving the pink tweezers. So that, and then, of course, then it comes with your white tray with the funnel. All right, so I set that off to the side. Oops. And of course, I get to drop everything. <clears throat> and it has, the baggie has the Treasure Studios Arts logo on the front. Adorbs, absolutely adorbs. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay, now, that canvas. This is a very, this is a large canvas. And it wants to stick. Sorry about the crinkle. Get that out of the way. Now, this here, also the difference, or this is a, this is a um, mounted adhesive, I think is what it's called. 
Yes, I think it's called a mounting adhesive. It's not poured glue like Diamond Art uses, and it is also, or Diamond Art, Diamond Art Club uses, and it is also not double-sided adhesive. This is a, like I said, a, like a mounted glue, mounting adhesive that it won't yellow over time like poured glue does. I have not seen that yet because, well, I haven't been diamond painting for all that long and I haven't um, hung anything yet. Everything is just covered in stacks off in the room. But so this is a mounting adhesive. I think that's what it's called. I hope I'm saying that right. This is oh, it's so gorgeous. The thumbnail. I can't even. It's called A Winter's End. And it is 100 by 60 centimeters. It's huge. It is definitely, definitely huge. But hold on one second. Okay, sorry about that. I'm back. That was a second for you. It was about 20 minutes for me. I had to take care of something. Now I need a drink. All right, so like I was saying, it is <clears throat> um, yeah, I can't think. I, I'm so excited about this. It's called A Winter's End and it's 100 by 60 centimeters. It has 30 colors and this is the thumbnail. I know it's a little hard to see, so bright. I don't know if that helps any or not. Oh, I can't get any closer. Yeah. So I had asked her to do when I messaged, uh, mentioned to her about the custom. Winter is my favorite season of the year. Um, I like the fall, fall and winter, but winter is my absolute favorite time of the year. And with, so that was what she was going to do. You know, she asked me what my interests were. Um, I told her and she said she would do it. Well, then she messaged me, I think it was late February, early March, mid February, maybe. And said that because with everything that was going on, with all the delays that were taking place, that it was going to be so much, it was going to be closer to spring when I got it. So she had some ideas and she wanted to bounce them off me. And I was like, yeah, what you got in mind? So she had said, well, why don't we do something like, you know, winter transitioning into spring where we'd still have some winter things, but it would be gradually working its way into spring. And I was just like, Rachel, that's, in, that's incredible. I love it. I love that idea. <clears throat> so that's what we've got. So let's go ahead and get into this. I like this canvas. This is different. It's not, you know, it's not the, um, it's not the soft velvety canvas like Diamond Art Club, but I, I do, I like this. This is a nice, it's a nice firm, sturdy canvas. I like it. And it's huge. I'm not going to be able to get all of this in the camera lens, um, no matter what. That's just not going to happen. There's, there's me. Um, yeah, I'm still unrolling. I'm still unrolling. I've just finished unrolling. Oh, God, this is huge. This is huge. And I have not seen it yet. Hang on here. Oh, oh my goodness. It's upside down. All right. So as you can see in that spot there, there's some deer. It is so light. It is so crazy light. Let me see if I can brighten this up a little bit. Or darken this a little bit. No, that's not going to work either. Yeah. It's just, there's, it's so bright outside here. My lighting is bad. And these are, the canvas itself is lighter. Um, it's not going to have a lot of dark colors. But there's, there's two deer here. And we've got what looks like a cherry blossom tree and right here I can get it get it in the oh, I am so sorry that I'm not able to get this whole thing in but 
right here it looks like there's a bird we got lots of pinks and blues purples oh goodness sakes here's a house Believe it or not, this is a house. You can see the snow, the snow-capped roof. There's gonna be some snow on the ground. And there's gonna be some, I see in the drills, there's some green in here. So like I said, I will go ahead and take a picture of this. And I have my um, Instagram, Facebook linked in the um, description block, box below. So you'll be able to see full pictures of it on there. I can get this out of the way. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be gorgeous. Okay, the drills. And it will, it does come with the um, inventory sheet. Sorry about the wrinkle. Out of here. Okay, so it is only in black and white at the time. Um, not sure. But eventually it will be, um, they will have color, I am assuming, but right now currently, color is currently not available. This is the thumbnail. This is what it's going to look like. So we've got what I said, what looks like might be a cherry blossom tree here. We've got, I'm guessing it's the moon, maybe. I don't know. I'm looking here. Sorry about all the, the noise. Yeah, and I don't have to look at these drills. I don't see any white drills. There's got to be white drills, but we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. Um, and then there's the little house. There's the bird. There's another tree there, and then there's the two deer. So let's see what we got here. It has a 30 colors, and it is square. And these drills look incredible so we've got 3838 we've got 820 3608 nice pink so we're gonna see lots of pinks and lots of purples are gonna be in this 3805 3806 I'm going to go ahead and put these in order while I'm doing it. So we got that. We've got 800. 38.59. That's actually, I think, what that's supposed to be. I don't know. I don't know. We've got 9.39. Nine thirteen, nine twelve, eight nineteen. Nice, we got cream, cream colored. <clears throat> eight twenty three, a big bag of thirty six oh nine. That's a big bag, and we got an even bigger bag. Well, same size bag, but. 3840. Yeah, these drills look good. There's some pitting in the drills, but that's not going to matter. As far as the shape goes, I don't see any um, nibs or any actual trash. Somebody somebody decided to, uh, I don't know what they did. This bag got burnt. <laughs> that bag got burnt. Somewhere I found sun. Um, 957. That's one bag of drills. There's two bags. Or two uh, sacks of drills. It does not want to give the drills up. Alright. Oh, goodness. All that noise. Sorry about that, people. This, these bags make so much noise. I'm going to throw it away because I'm not going to keep them. All right, and then we got 155, another really, really pretty purple. Look at that, is that purple? Beautiful. So 155, 3806, another pink. 
792. One of my favorite blues. 793. Another blue. 799. 3721. 327. 550. Rachel Ray's favorite purple. 797. Yeah, very little brown in this. Probably the only brown we're going to really see is going to be in the deer and like the tree trunks. 995. 209. Look at this bag of 209. This is filled to the brim. You couldn't get another drill in there if you tried. 564. Yeah, and I'm showing these all to you upside down. So now I get to turn around the right way. I apologize. 967. 552. Or, yeah. I don't know, 552. I was looking at it upside down. I was dyslexic there for a minute. 797. And 208. So, yeah. Lots and lots and lots of drills. And like I said, it is square. And again, it is 60 by 100 centimeters. And <coughs> the name of it is A Winter's End. Treasure Studios Art. This is my very first painting by them. Rachel, you knocked it out of the ballpark. I could not have imagined this being any more beautiful than what it is. And I, I just cannot wait to work on this. So, um, <clears throat> this will be available for purchase on the website during the time of which me and Amber will be doing our collab collaboration. After our collaboration is over, I don't know how long she'll keep it up, but this will not be um, available for purchase forever, but it will be um, during the time of our collab. We just need to get with Rachel and get our time scheduled, and I will get the information for this, and it will be in the uh, description box below. So please go over to Treasure Studios Arts website. I will have that in the description box below. Below, There are absolutely beautiful paintings there right now. Um, a lot of bodyscapes. I'm sure several people have um, made videos of those. I know Patriotic Beauty has, she is a um, affiliate for Treasure Studios Arts, so you can always go to Patriotic Beauty's website or YouTube channel. Um, Rebecca from Diamond Painting Journey with Rebecca, she's also an affiliate with Treasure Studios Studios Arts, and I don't even know why I didn't message this person first, simply because she is who actually introduced us to Treasure Studios Arts way back. Sherry, A.K.A. Diamond Art Addiction. She as well is an affiliate. Um, I'm, I know there's more, but I can't think of them off the top of my head. But if you're interested in a Treasure Studios Arts and you want to see some unboxings, you can always go to your YouTube channel, type in the top in the search bar, Treasure Studios Arts Diamond Painting Unboxings, and it will bring up any Treasure Studios Arts unboxings that have been recorded. So we've got... This little guy here, I don't know. He's, I, I got a few, I get a few uh, that either are colorblind and jumped in the wrong bag or they just wanted to uh, party with their friends. I don't know. I don't know. But this is absolutely, and I just threw that, this is absolutely more than I could have ever imagined for it to turn out. I love it, Rachel. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate this. This was just, it's been a journey. And I will remember this painting always. Thank you for doing this for me and Amber, as well as giving us a product that 
this this canvas looks unbelievable and I forgot to mention I checked this I'm sorry I'm sorry it's just because it's so big it's so hard it's it's unruly it's unmanageable <laughs> on my table right now but <clears throat> I'm gonna check show you the um, drill field and I'm gonna pull back this cover here oh this is crazy sticky this is I've never had I've worked on several different brands and I've never had one so sticky. It goes off away from the image about a quarter to a half an inch. Nothing that bad, nothing that washi can't take, can't take care of. And if you get that and it does bother you, you can use baby wipes along the edge. Let's get up here into this drill field. I know it's probably not real clear for you at this to see because the lighting is so bad and all that. But the drill field looks absolutely crystal. I mean, it is, I have no, I will have no problems um, working on this. Well, I don't know. Let me see here. I may have, I may have a little bit of issue with some of these. I don't know. It might work better when it's on a light pad because they are light colors. trying to see here number five might be a little difficult number five is kind of like I don't know this is this is what um, uh, the one drill or symbol is right let me see here right here between my thumbs right above the X that one looks like it might be a little difficult to make out I'm going to have to put this on my light pad and see. And if I have any issues, I can let, um, let Rachel know. But, yeah, I'm very anxious to work on this. And we will be doing um, live videos. We're pretty sure me and um, Amber will be doing live videos on Saturdays. We just need to get the time scheduled. And then we are also going to be doing... Um, whipping chats throughout the week. Um, I think we're going to do whipping chats on Wednesday where we will have a series of tag questions that we will both answer, um, answer the same question and be like comparing, you know, her questions to mine. So, sorry this was such a crazy video. Things are difficult. It's so bright outside. It is like 90 degrees, going to be 96 degrees here in Las Vegas today. The sun is extremely, oh, ex there's no clouds. It is so bright outside that I can't close my blinds and my curtains because then I won't be able to see. But when I have them open, then it's too bright. So I'm going to go ahead, get off here. I'm going to go ahead and get this uploaded, get the information that you need. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, that's okay. Um, I'm, I'm trying. And please share and if you want to see more videos like this, whether it be unboxings, whipping chats, I do.